Good morning guys, and how are you doing this morning? Look at me, up and about. I thought I'd take you for a little walk round this morning, do something different. Last time I did, last time I came here with Emma, I took you out for a, a little walk round and people seem to like that. It is 7.30 in the morning, believe it or not, and the sun is out, there's no, sky, there's no um, clouds in the sky. It's gorgeous. Um, so I thought I'd have a little walk round, take you with me. Show you what's going on in the mornings. There's a few people out, everyone's starting to get ready for the day. Bart buses are out already, look. All the people and the staff are going to work, getting ready for the day. Spending our money in their bars and their restaurants and everything else, yeah? <laughs> we love it. Right, I'll turn you around. I'm on soy cow. <laughs> Food vendors are out already. Everyone's having a good time. <laughs> Especially me, because I only had four beers. I, I did have a beer last night. I said I wouldn't, but I went out and had a couple of beers. I walked down to see Phil at um, the pub. I had a beer in there and I ended up having one just across the road before I went to bed. So I was a good boy and I'm up fresh as a daisy this morning ready for the day. So, um, yeah, let's have a little walk down, shall we? I don't know where we'll go. Let's go up to Chaipoon and see how flooded it is. I don't know if it rained last night. The rain don't look like it's been on the floor too much. So maybe we'll be all right. Um, yeah, it was busy out last night. Um, I went down to LK Metro, had a little look around there. Uh, went in the time bar, had a Sprite and I poked my head in Lady Love just to see how busy it was. I didn't go in there, I, I just poked my head in there and it was absolutely rammed with people. I couldn't believe it. Really, really busy. So there's a lot of stuff going on at the moment. Um, should I walk up Lenky? No, there's nothing going on up Lenky. Look, it's, uh, there is a doornail up there at the moment, so we won't go up there. There's the monks, I'm not going to film the monks. A couple of young lads there as well, look. a couple of young, very young monks. I don't know, 10, 12 years old, I suppose they looked. Yeah, so big cow. Nice and quiet at the moment. Not too busy. Everyone's getting the food out ready, it smells lovely. Right, it's quite chai poon, have a little look up here, all right? Um, I walked up here last night and all. Yeah, very busy, but the the road was flooded and people were having trouble getting round. Went past the Las Vegas beer garden last night, that was rammed. There's quite a few people out here this time of year. I know it's low season, but yeah, there's loads and loads and loads of people out. I don't want to upset anyone with the uh, camera. Hopefully it'll be a bit early for anyone to be out, but normally there's ladyboys up here and they don't like me filming them. Girls are getting ready for the massage day. Morning! <laughs> oh, they're all friendly this morning, that's nice. At least they're not shouting at me. Um, yeah, I've been telling you guys for the last few days it's getting more and more difficult to, uh, it's getting more and more difficult to film at night. People get really upset about it. Yeah. But I've got to keep doing it. I can't just stop, can I? <laughs> Inferno, this place here. They do do a good breakfast in there. Nothing's open yet, it's a bit early, it's only half past seven in the morning. So, you might even find some people doing a walk of shame this morning, I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah, so, I had a little walk down Walking Street Way. It was good down there. Very, very busy. I'm quite surprised how busy it was, to be fair. I mean, I was here eight, eight or nine weeks ago with Emma, and we went up there, and it wasn't that busy then. It's definitely, definitely, definitely busy now. There was tons and tons and tons of people out. They must have been doing a roaring trade. Let's turn the camera back. Oh, guys. <laughs> yeah, 
So I walk in street. If you're coming out here, don't be worried about the bars being empty. Fucking hell, there was hundreds of people out. All the girls in the bars, there's, you know, there's just tons of people about. You're, you're not, you're not going to be, uh, you're going to be sport for choice, put it that way, if that's what, if that's what you're into. You know I me, mean? I don't do that, but there's a, a fair few people about, if you know what I mean. Right, this place here, I've had a message from the guy who runs this place. He said, can you come in and say hello? Maggie Mays. I've never been in there. I think it's a closed bar. It is, it's like a, I don't know if it's like a gents club or what, but yeah, Maggie Mays. Right opposite um, Trev's bar, look. I ain't been in there either yet. Every time I go in, every time I walk past, there's hundreds of people outside, I'm thinking, well, I've got nowhere to sit. <laughs> so he must be doing all right. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna visit Maggie Mays. I'll probably take the internet sensation with me. We'll go in there and uh, have a chat with the manager and see what it's like in there. Might get him to give me a, he, well, he might get me to give him a little review of what it's like. And I'll, I'll be honest about that. I'm, you know, full disclosure, I won't, if he's asked me to come in there and he buys me a beer, I'm not gonna say it's good if it's rubbish, but I'm sure it's not because I've heard good things about Maggie Mays over the years. Other YouTubers telling me what's going on. Um, right, so tonight, tonight we're going to go to um, Walking Street. Hopefully, I'm going to get I'm going to get Neil to come out. I'm going to get Neil to come out, and uh, we'll go down and walk. Right, there you go. This is Third Road. That's my hotel where I stayed last time I came with Emma. Yeah, okay, Preston. It's good in there. Not bad at all. This uh, this place I'm staying at at the moment, the Debua, is just a it's a little bit nicer. It's um, it's not got any breakfast. There's no gym or anything like that, if that's what you want. So, if you're after that, you'll have to go somewhere else, but I don't go to the gym or anything like that. I don't need to do any of that crap. Let the girls go past. Yeah, um, so there's no breakfast, no gym, but the rooms are lovely, very clean. The uh, cleaning staff are great. He woke me up yesterday at three o'clock and said, do you want me to do your room? You haven't had it done for three days. I said, yes, please. <laughs> so I jumped up quick, got me, got, me, got me shorts on and that and just left him in the room. Bless him, bunged him under a bar. Little tip for you guys, if you're, uh, if you're new here and you get to your hotel, make friends with the cleaning staff. Bung them an under a bar every now and then, all right? They give you extra waters, extra sugars for your coffees, and they'll look after you. They'll come and, they'll come and clean your room a bit earlier because sometimes you might have gone out for the afternoon for a few beers, and you get back at three, four o'clock for a little siesta before you go out in the evening, and they're banging on the door saying, hey, you want us to clean your room? And I'm like, no, piss off. <laughs> but if you give them a couple of under a bar over the time you're there, they might come and do yours a bit earlier. There you go, top tip from me. So I'm going to Lenky now. There's the Vogue. Stayed there as well, the Vogue's all right and all. No, no dramas with the Vogue. They do breakfast in there. Um, a couple of nice little pools in there. It's cheap as well, so. And you're right in the middle of everything, but you're not too noisy. You get what I mean? What you don't want to do, just book yourself an hotel where all you've got is a nightclub down below, you're booming all night, you to do your head in. You wouldn't be able to do that. Um, yeah, so just be mindful of where you're booking. Read your reviews, do your due diligence, you'll be fine. <laughs> Turn you back round. Soy Lenky. Wake up, hello! That's the lady boy. She, she, I knew her from when me and Neil come the first time. She recognises you. That's one thing you'll find about these type of people. They do not forget you. And I mean that. It's mad how, how good their memories are. They remember every single thing you do and they remember your face. I went into Noid Bar the other day and uh, they went, oh, how's, how's Emma? How's her mosquito bites? And I'm like, how the hell do they remember? They must be hundreds of customers. How do they remember everything? But they do, they've got, they got bloody brilliant memories. So they remember all the good stuff you do, and I expect if you're playing up and being a dick, they'll remember all the bad things you do as well. <laughs> so just be careful. 
Right, where are we going to go next? Should we have a little walk down Saw Diana? Yeah, let's do that. We'll have a little walk down Saw Diana and then I'll walk up LK Metro. Show you LK Metro. And then uh, I'll conclude this morning's video with that, all right? Hope you don't mind doing this. If you like, if you like me doing these little walk around videos, then let me know in the comments. Um, the last one I did, I only did one. I know a couple of other YouTubers do these, like Trev doesn't, doesn't he? I just thought it'll break, break up the monotony of uh, me yammering on and, and being drunk. And uh, at least I'm not in bed this morning, eh, guys? I'm up, I'm up and about. And I feel okay, I'm not, I'm not hanging or anything, so that's really good news. <laughs> there we go. Soy big cow. Don't get run over. There you go, we're all right, we're good. So you've got um, a spaghetti thing there, the spaghetti lady. She's pretty good. Nice food. It's okay, I'm not filming you, darling. There you go. Yeah, so the spaghetti lady's quite good. Always ordering food from there. It's, uh, it's very nice. And uh, coming out here, just opposite LK Metro, is this new beer garden. I showed you it the other day on the camera when it was open, but yeah, it's, uh, it's really good in there. It's, there's loads of people in there. You've got a few freelancers in there. And you also got like, girls with numbers on them so I'm presuming they're like actually employed by the by the bars in there you know you can buy them a drink it's about 90 bar 90 bar a drink in there so that's not too bad um, but it's an open bar but it's nice and cool which is quite quite weird yeah it's quite weird because it's normally the open bars ain't got aircon but that one has and it's uh it's nice and cool in there and the bar the the um the band was good. They were playing some good tunes. Yeah, I've got the covers down at the moment. Obviously, it's too early in the morning, but you've got some people up, look, already, look, these guys are having a beer already. It's half past seven in the morning. Not for me. Yeah, there's the Las Vegas beer garden right there, look. Right opposite LK Metro. Right opposite LK Metro. Right, I'm going to have a walk down LK. Um, and then once I've done that, I'll conclude today's video and then you'll see one, see me tonight. We'll have a nice uh, night out at Walking Street, hopefully, if I can get Neil out. Bless him. I'm gonna tell him to get his ass out of bed. Right, look, there's a go-to place here, look. Lady Love, I'll keep going on about Lady Love. Mrs. moans at me for going on about Lady Love, but you've got to give it its due, it's good in there. Um, yeah, they, the staff look after you. Just walk in there. Bung your server under a bar, just sit in a good seat and keep an eye on your drinks, make sure you've always got a drink in your hand. <laughs> Jaeger bombs are our go-to in there. Kink's there, look. You all know about Kink. Emma knows about Kink. I took her to Kink, didn't I? Um, Crystal Go-Go, always busy in there. And then you've got the Queen Club here. I've never been in there, but I've heard it's really good. And you've got your um, little bars here, Cafe Racer, R Rovers, always good for a breakfast in there. R Rovers is there, look, next to Angels. Angels is all right as well. <laughs> bit mad, but they're all a bit mad down here. Las Vegas a go-go, that's always rammed. And then you've got my little time, but you got my little time bar. Excellent food in there, good breakfast, cheap beer. Always good, for a, always good for a start to your evening, if you know what I mean. If you're in LK Metro, come down to the time bar, you can have a couple of beers in there first, quite cheap, and then go and spend all your dough in the uh, go-go's if that's what you want to do. <laughs> There's a couple of girls walking down there, I'm not going to film them. I'm not going to film them. I'm not going to film the girls. I don't know where they're going. They look like they were dressed up for a night out, it's a bit early. Maybe they're coming home. <laughs> you know the crack guys, don't you? The walk of shame. So yeah, 
Um, a few of these bars here are always busy as well. You've got the bar find, barcode, catch me. I don't know if that's open or not. I think it is. Top Gunner Go Go. There's a few out last night there. And then you've got your famous Sugar Sugar. Sugar Sugar's always busy. Um, this guy here, I've been recommended. He does fish and chips every day. One of my friends told me that this is pretty good. How much is it? 130 baht for fish and chips, look. Fucking hell, it's cheap, isn't it? <laughs> Spend 15 quid on a bit of fish and chips at home. So there you go. I hope you've enjoyed my little walk around. I'm gonna go back, uh, back towards the hotel now, see if I can find some breakfast somewhere. So, there you go. Little walk around the town in the morning, up past seven in the morning, just showing you what's going on. Um, thank you for all the support, you're still loving my videos and, and watching them. Every morning I'll get up and you've, there's been a thousand views on my videos, which is brilliant. Um, there's loads on there, guys. If you're new here, go back and have a look at some of the older ones. When I first started coming here, we were mental then. I've, I've, I've got myself a little bit less crazy now, but back then we were having it, me and Neil. We're still having it now, but you know what I mean? We was a little bit less, uh, a little less nuts. Well, we are now a little less nuts than what we were back then. So, um, let me just jump across the road here and I'll finish the video off. Right, so, this is Soy, soy Typhoon. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna walk back down towards my hotel now, all right? Thank you for joining me this morning. And uh, there'll be a video coming tonight. Walking street, hopefully. If I'm getting Neil out of bed, we'll be good. Right, guys, thank you very much. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the like button, all right? It really helps me out. My videos are getting shared more and more and more on YouTube. So, yeah, keep hitting the like, keep hitting the subscribe. I love you all, you legends. And hello, you legends. <laughs> See you later.